Hi, Andrew from Azito. For every project, large or small, there's a tool in the range from Azito. So today we're going to be doing a pot plant holder, which is quite a dynamic one. Depending on the size of the pot, depends on how big your pot plant holder will be. Okay, let's get into it. So, get the specs on, and we've got a piece of timber here. Now I already know that this is going to suit the size of the pot that I'm doing, so I'll be creating a base, and we'll be cutting this up with our miter saw, and then stitching it all together with a few screws, and then cut a circle on top for our pot plant to sit in. So, we're going to create a measurement for our top and bottom of our pot holder. Let's put this one onto the miter saw. Let's line it up. Okay, so that can be the bottom. Now we just need to create the top. Let's do the next cut. Now we need to put some walls in there so they can stand up on. Let's use the tape measure. So we will need two of these, so let's do another one. So we're going to screw that piece together now and then we're going to cut a hole in the top which will suit our pot plant. So we'll clamp it and it's not perfect right now so while we're clamping that gives us time, we won't do it fully tight, it gives us time to actually adjust the walls so they match. I always like to use things that are around me to be already my height to mark where I want my screws. Four screws, four pilot holes. quickly change him over to the driver bit. I'm just going to pop it into first gear so it spins a little bit slower for me so I can drive that screw in. Now all we need to do is repeat it at the other side here. So what we need to determine is what the measurement is across the inside of that pot through there. Then we're going to put that same size circle or slightly smaller circle than the rim of the pot there on there and then we're going to use a jigsaw to cut it out. What I'm now going to do is find the centre of my pot plant holder. Let's just draw a line from corner to corner. So this is my homemade compass I suppose. So what I'm going to do is drive this screw into the centre, the mark on the centre there. Drive my screw in there, and we draw our line all the way around. We can now take the screw out. We will need a drill driver to uh, start the hole, to find a place to start out with our jigsaw. Here we go, let's get into it. Obviously we've got a few rough edges here, so we've got a few rough edges in here and around the ends. So we want to pretty this up because we may want to paint it, we may want to stain it. So let's get a detail sander. An 80 grit paper is good to just clean this sort of stuff up. So there you have it. There's our pot plant holder. 